Welcome back, guys. Let's go ahead and jump into this collective read. Let's see what's going on. What's going on? Yeah, what's going on? What's going on? Give me a message for the collective, please. <laughs> oh, really, 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 really. Okay. So at the bottom of the deck, guys, we got the Emperor to be dealing with the Aries. Ooh, real, real masculine energy here. Like this person is very, very egotistical, could be very... um. Conceited, arrogant, could be a fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries. All this passion right here. We got the Ace of Wands. Oh, okay. All right. So let's see what's going on. This person could be older. This person could be a boss. Very much so, boss. The king of pentacles and the nine of pentacles jumped out. So it could be Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Lots of earth energy here. Definitely Capricorn. We got the devil right here. And the sun could be a Leo involved. I'm getting a Libra. As well, 11 11 on the clock. All right, so somebody is feeling like they missed the opportunity. You could be feeling like you missed the opportunity, um, or you feel like drained, you're not seeing anything about it. But you feel drained, okay? It could be in regards to like an opportunity. Um, you feel like it's slipping away, or could be financial. Somebody that you're dealing with has some um with the devil and the sun. That's definitely giving me sex, sexual energy here. Okay. I'm getting like, yeah, look at this. This King of Wands. I'm getting like, there's a lot of passion here. You and this person has have a lot of passion. But for some reason, I feel like you're spying on this person. Why are you spying on them? You're spying on this person. I feel like you're trying to get some information from this person. But they're not telling you something. Like, you feel like there's something missing. You feel like there's something missing. Feel like you give this person what they want sexually that's not a problem whatever it is that you're providing them or give it to them sexually they fall for it every time we got the strength card here it could be a leo you could be a leo they could be a leo 
whatever you're doing sexual-wise, that's not a problem. That's not an issue. I feel like this person that you're dealing with, the reason that you could be keeping an eye on them is because they're sneaky. So you could be considering switching things up. Reeling them in. Um, it's like something you like. That's not over yet. That's not done yet. Um, what's the star here? Oh, the Empress. There could be a pregnancy. Maybe you were pregnant before from this person. This person could have, you may, could have got rid of the baby for some. We got the Six of Swords, Ten of Pentacles, the Magician, and the Eight of Cups. Okay, tell me more about this Empress and the Star. The Six of Wands. You may feel like you're the perfect person for this person. And I'm also getting like the chemistry, uh, the attraction, all of that is there. Tell me why, what's going on with this Empress and this star? The Phoenix and Palm Tree. Tell me more about the Phoenix. Yes, I'm getting someone definitely could. Someone could need to get a divorce. We got the Grim Reaper and Paradise. Someone may need to get a divorce. Like I said, the passion is there. That's no problem. I see you wanting this connection to evolve. Um, some of you may feel like this person is your twin flame. Like, I feel like you're over here giving this a lot. You're giving this a lot of energy. But I feel like sometimes you may feel like you're going to regret the decision. Because I feel like you're spying on this person. You're, trying to, you're, you're watching this person. Like, what are they doing with their finances? Um, they hide things. Yeah, there's that four of wands again. And see, you're confused about something. You're trying to figure out where you stand with this person or what is making this person starting to act funny, maybe sneak off, maybe doing some little, you know, got some little sneaky little ways. Because you feel like, look, everything that you've been asking for, I've been, you know, been handling that. Yeah, I'm getting that. There's a separation or a divorce that's the challenge it's been a long time um like it's been dra drug out somebody needs to get some type of lawyer divorce lawyer yeah like somebody you could be telling this person like look you need to get this divorce started if you want my help um some of y'all are willing to even help this person 
get a lawyer to start the process. Something cost a lot. Maybe it cost a lot for this person to walk away from this other situation. So some so this person feels stuck. Yeah, this is oh yeah, the tower and the knight of swords. Some of y'all could find out that you're pregnant. And somebody's saying that they, you could be saying that you're going to keep it this time. You say, look, it's not my fault. Some of y'all. Yeah, it's like you're surprised how quick something happened. You could be feeling like you should have waited or been more patient. some shocking news. Some of y'all find out that y'all are pregnant. That's the strength cord. In the past, it looks like like the connection that you were in it was it was lacking a lot of stuff like it was lacking it wasn't giving what it was supposed to be giving um it seems like it was kind of stressful i feel like you had to do a lot of waiting on this person to try to figure some things out yeah because this person is kind of like in and out all the time can't get any consistent energy from this person. And I feel like that was past energy. I feel like some of y'all... I feel like some of y'all find, find out that you are pregnant. Why's the Eight of Pentacles here? Future energy, it looks like y'all could be tired of trying. Y'all been waiting on this connection to get to the next level. Um, and I feel like you feel like you could be just feel stuck. Like I'm getting like this person could have left someone else to come be with you, and you like, okay, well, what now? What now? Like, I'm getting somebody talking trash the whole time about somebody possibly being married um but not giving it the situation time um somebody feels like somebody's too inconsistent somebody wanted to force so this is again Wands. Leo Sagittarius Aries. That's a fire energy here. Yeah, see, I, I, I'm getting like a little bit of boredom, like kind of getting bored with the connection. I feel like you've been giving this connection all you got. I'm hearing if you go back, someone could be considering going back to a old to a ex. And I also see too that someone is saying, yo, that's real, that's real effed up. You talked all that mess about that connection. 
Then if you get caught cheating, then what? Do you think you could come back? I'm seeing somebody's waiting on someone waiting on a new car or is trying to purchase a new car. Um somebody's feeling like somebody's gonna change, but they not. Mm. Why is the king of wands here? Yeah, you feel like you got to wait. Like, this person puts you on hold a lot. You want this person to make up their mind. Do they want to be together or not? I gotta pull some more because this is interesting. Tell me more about this connection here. Tell me more about this connection. Oh, some spine going on for sure. It's lots of sex and all of that going on. Um, we got the golden mirror, self-absorbed narcissist, one-sided relationship. See the the person that you're that you're dealing with is one-sided. This is a one-sided relationship. The sex is good, but you just could end up being heartbroken. And like I said, somebody could be somebody could be finding out the truth about somebody could be married. This person is a runner. They a track star. This person in love is in love with abundance. They love what they can get out of this uh, connection. And then watch your back because this person could stab you in the back. Now, this person loves to stab. This is a karmic. This is a karmic relationship. We got a girl with the snake. You could be... Dealing with somebody who is a straight up narcissist. Karmic relationship. This is karmic and masculine. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. And I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao.